We back in the field. Back. We ready, it's time. Ready. It's nothing but hustle inside of the huddle. You know that I grind. A dangerous mind, a weapon of choice when pushing the line. Pushing the line. Go over time and I won't break when it's crunch time. Yeah. Legendary like legacy. Legend. This is our moment. Game time. Prepping for the Game Changer Summit. So it is time for the morning walk with the latest. Leading up to the summit, I find that as you get close to potentially like stressful events, this is where sleep goes, exercise goes, diet goes, and then you come in and you're just a shadow of yourself. So my aim is to, is to always avoid that. You don't have to get ready if you stay ready. You always gotta stay within striking distance. Uh, I told Jessica, you know, it's how cool it is being the biggest dude in the gym. Because I'm the only, only dude that goes to this gym. Here we go. Get up early, got the greens, you know. It's kind of like an insurance policy. You know, so I do eat a lot of fruits and vegetables, but I also think it helps to take a greens powder. No, we're not doing product placement, but this is the world's greatest shaker. Whoever came up with this is like an innovator beyond their time. Still a few days out from the Game Changer Summit, so we're working on any of the final prep, proving content, finishing up presentations, working out anything logistically. So many members of the team that have been working on this summit nonstop the last several months, so it's gonna be exciting. You know, and just have a great, you know, great experience here in Atlanta and set up the rest of the year. So what's your like ultimate get hype track? Oh man, you know, I've been listening to, we have a, uh, every year we create a playlist at the summit. And Spotify, just, you know, it's like Game Changer Summit 2023. I mean, it's eclectic. Sometimes you just want to jam out some Beethoven. Sometimes you want to get a little Calvin Harris. I mean, I, I even think about, okay, this would be a great track during a break, or this is a great walk-on song, or a great walk-off song, you know, whatever the mood strikes. This car is an absolute blast to drive. Uh, these cars go to our clients, you know, they're like, why do you give cars away? It's like, well, turns out people like them. When we were talking about an Aston Martin, something like this, I mean, don't get me wrong, I think white car looks clean, but a green, green is ridiculous. They need to have like its own elite compilation. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. It should be an elite compilation from their compilation, Chris Beck's compilation. Shit, we should consider like after this video ends to like brighten it up or something. Color Just color because color. like, I mean, they're gonna want, I think it's good to have the, the name of the award and the name of the firm because that's what they're gonna want to take pictures of and like, especially on social. Like when the video is done. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. At the end, yeah. bring the colors back. Yeah, I can see it, man. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. colorblind kid. You remember those things? Like, like dogs, dog, dogs colorblind? Yeah, dogs are colorblind. Yeah. Wow. How do they know? <laughs> How do they know? <laughs> ask, ask How do the dogs dog? know? <laughs> right now we looked at the, uh, the cornea. And then that, the when real. that shit hits. That way, that Anything before this moment essentially is like the event's still coming together or whatever. Once this shit starts, that's it. You better you better be on stage. Time's ticking. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, Michael Mogul. Ask a question. DJ Danny's really not playing that. Does your hold keep going? Or does DJ Danny have a song? He will not be playing anything. Right, that song okay. should play all the way through. That's why, Six. like, yeah, yeah, we, got, we got a song for basically three and a half, almost four minutes. And then when I'm up on stage, then I'll say, oh, thank you. And they obviously they can drop the music. music. Yes. Just okay, playing. so then. So then John. John. Okay, then. DJ we do... will play during his walk up. Okay. okay. Right? Cool. 
pump up. Are you guys excited? Stay in your seat. <laughs> I want to be. Yeah, my goal is to be the MC of this, of this event. Have somebody else do the presentations. It's AI. My goal is to get no. to the point where Were somebody else MC? does all this shit, and I just MC. But see, the you thing know? is, is that you would go off on a tangent, and then you would be the MC that we all hate. Yeah. Please welcome to the stage, me, Michael Mogul. Me. <laughs> me. Please welcome me. Please welcome to the stage, me, Michael Mogul. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's actually pretty good. Right Today we're learning what it takes to put together a summit. <laughs> so we'll walk you through the routine. So right here we got eggs, egg whites, and then on top we have a little bit of that Frank's Red Hot. I got a whole, I got a whole set, but with eggs, you can't beat this, this Frank's Red Hot. Here we go. I always feel like with any event, and this, this being the sixth one, it's interesting how much comes together in the last few weeks. Right now, it's finishing up presentations, reviewing videos. It's good. I'm not at that freak out phase just yet. I mean, because the event itself is still, it, it requires a lot of energy. I mean, you're on, you know, from, you know, once once that music plays, we were talking about it yesterday, once that countdown music starts right. to play, it's right. like, we become like Pavlov's dog, yeah. where I'm like, all right, like once that music hits to through the next two days, it's like showtime. I got to speak with Barbara Corcoran yesterday. We did a call uh, talking about the summit. She's really excited. She's gonna she's gonna deliver a great presentation. It'll be interesting to see what the fireside chat looks like with uh, with Flow Rider. I'm excited for that. And then of course Wayne Gretzky. Um, it's just an awesome lineup this year. Yeah. You know, it's like we kick off the event. I know we don't share an agenda, but it's like knowing right from, from right from the get go, from the start, day one, and it just goes sh straight in. Great speaker, great speaker, great speaker, great speaker. Then you get to day two, great speaker, great speaker. And it's just, yeah. um, it's awesome. Here we are Saturday, you know, as the saying goes, right? It takes what it takes. Um, you know, it's, uh, you just gotta do it. Just gotta get it done. I mean, I had this conversation with Jessica last night in, in the sense that I just don't have it in me to put together like a B product. Like it's gotta be an A. So that requires, you know, another level of, of detail, another level of, of polish and just execution. This weekend, you know, we've been working on these presentations for the last month. The goal for this weekend is to finish two out of three. So these are like the final polish. This is going through all the slides, any sort of design edits, any sort of tweaks and changes that need to be made just structurally, flow-wise. It's making sure the event stays high energy, exciting, engaging from the start to the end. So it feels good to get things done. It really does. You win the day and uh, and then you can, you know, you can spend your time, you know, however, however leisurely you like, but you can feel good about it, right? You earned it. So right here is presentation three. This one right now is at about 163 slides. By the time it's done, it'll, it'll probably be a little bit shorter. It'll probably be closer to maybe uh, 130, 120. One of the presentations, for example, is in like 18 pages written out of just, you know, just text, right? And then you turn that into slides, but then the slides themselves, sometimes they don't flow the same way they do in, in an outline. So you make sure that there's good transitions between the different elements. And then use, you know, then we send it to design. And when we get the design back, then we kind of work through how we're going to present information, the information architecture of it. Um, that goes through a series of revisions, you know, and that's just one presentation, but you, you know, we're working on three simultaneously. So, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's a journey.
Yeah, I'ma do it all in bold, bold Big letters cause I'm bold, bold On the map, round the Got a lot up my sleeve in the pipeline Yeah, we stepping on the gas, got a new drive We already made Are you ready? Do it all in bold, bold Big letters cause I'm bold, bold On the map, round the globe, globe Yeah, we putting on a show, everybody gonna know I'ma do it all in bold what, what was it? And uh, I think it was like the disaster artist. He had his own bathroom, you know, <laughs> his own toilet. But it's like we got VIP and then we got VVIP. The best is when you forget the camera's there. In fact, when Ethan points the camera at other people, yeah. they get real cool. That's the best part. <laughs> like, someone would be like, hmm. You know? <laughs> Come on, man. You know we can't use that. Yeah. Well, we've done it again. <laughs> I just want to show you the car video and let you see the whole thing. Get what the, the car? feel it. You I just car? want you to see. <laughs> This is a presentation. Backlight. Yeah. Stage one. So this is how dark it is in the room Correct. for presentations. Yeah. Yeah. All the lights are on the room. Do you want to click through a presentation and then do your walk-in, or do you want to do your walk-in as and then go to your presentation? Let's do the walk-in. Let's do I it. I like it. All Let's right. So we're gonna do the whole thing. Do it. Audio check. Everything's good. Slides are looking good. Screens are looking good. Walking in, I was blown away. Okay, like, and when I think when people see the screens and when they see this setup, they're gonna be blown away as well because it really envelops the whole room. And then the sounds blast, and we got this red carpet in the middle, which is a kind of a new thing. And usually, I'm all cracked out, and nervous at this point, and right now I'm feeling pretty good. So I hope we get you know some good sleep tonight. Um, get up early, you know, get ready to go. So I'm just pumped to get started, man. Onto the carpet. Come on. Awesome. All right. Sixth event, sixth summit. How are you guys feeling? Woo! So, here's what I can tell you. Everything looks amazing. The videos are amazing. The content is amazing. The speakers are amazing. So now we just gotta execute. And I know you guys are gonna do an amazing job. My recommendation is that you it's gonna sound a little cheesy, but like try to be in the present and try to cherish these things because it'll be over before you know it. Clients are here, they're really excited to be here. They love this. This is like an incredible experience. They're gonna come up and give you guys a bunch of hugs. Like it's awesome that we get to do this. Let's crush it out and then we'll do the photo. All right, here we go. All right. Run, run, crush it! Truly valuable firm is one that can grow even in your absence. Strength of a leader is not in the tightness of their grip, but in their ability to let go and trust. If you're focusing solely on today, you're gonna to fail to prepare your organization to be competitive in the future. Hello, sharks. 
My name is Tim Jimson, and I'm the founder and CEO of Jimson Law. This is a fake shark tank pitch. He doesn't look frightened. <laughs> oh, you will be by the end. Yeah. Oh, he's frightened. Oh. <laughs> it's so good. It's very convincing. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage Barbara Corcoran. I get a standing ovation when I enter the room. This feels good. I like you people. In this room, we'll be walking away with the keys to Michael's very own Aston Martin. And they won't think it's fixed at all. Another quote, um, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Is there a shot that you never took? I didn't call Taylor Swift. This being Game Changer Summit, what does being a Game Changer mean to you? Oh man, Game Changer to me, that's totally disruption, being disruptive. When I woke up today, I told myself, I'm gonna make history, and that's what Game Changer means to me. We got two cans of Celsius right here, so you still, you still drinking Celsius? Of course. Badass Martin Vantage, Sean Olson. We thank you guys for joining us this Thursday and Friday at the Game Changer Summit. We wish you all safe travels home, and we'll see you again soon. That's a wrap. It was a good event. Everybody, uh, super professional. Everyone was on point. And this being the sixth event, um, just, you know, same AV team, same DJ, like, same event manager. Like, there's so many of us just veterans that it just makes it easy. Everybody knows what they're supposed to do, when they're supposed to do it. So this, being a members-only event, of course, was all about our clients. I think every time we call out a winner for any of the Game Changer Awards, we did seven of these awards. Every time, like, the winner came up, like, one, of course, they were happy, they were thrilled, like they had tears in their eyes, but then you could tell that other people in the room were also really happy for them. So I think that that was amazing. Like every single time we called the winner out, they were just like, just blown away. When does the prep for the next one begin? Well, probably actually a few weeks ago because we're already locked in the venue, but then we just start already thinking about that one. I start the notes doc, I start already thinking about the themes. What are we gonna talk about? What are the presentations gonna be? And it's like, it, it starts literally, it's like today's November 3rd. What is it right now? 5.15, you know, 5.20. We're working on the next one. Well, you got some cupcakes to enjoy. Yeah, we got to crush these cupcakes, <laughs> and then we got to address the team. <laughs> yeah, let's go around the room. We can, we can kind of close out. Um, I could go on forever. Honestly, um, I can speak to every single human in this room. I do want to shout out just a handful. Um, Laura. Yeah. <laughs> Laura to become the MC, probably one of my all-time favorite moments at Chris. Um, and she more than delivered, honestly. So yeah, it's a, just a testament to you guys. Like we are literally able to just show up, do what we've got to do, and just know that literally everything else is handled. So thank you guys. Look, you guys worked your asses off. Everyone was just, I mean, we were talking about this earlier with Christy, like there's a million things going on from like what assets about to get loaded up to what speakers coming on, what speakers coming off, like who's doing what, but it's so calm. 
Like it really is so calm. Like it's just, it's awesome. You know, we'll come back because now, you know, what's the reward for, for great work is uh, more work. So, thank you guys. Seriously, thank you. Thank you. All right, here we go. Crash, crash, crash. I left a stain on it I'ma pass a torch before a blame